Hi everyone. I said in my last video that I would come back and let you know how I got on knitting these three bears. Um, they're the King Cole Looks for Bears and here they are. So far I've done Daddy Bear, you can see here, he's really cute. And I've done Baby Bear too. I've done one in Beaver, which is a baby bear, and the other one in Silver Fox. And as you can see, they've come out really well. They're really cute bears. They will sit up with a bit of help. They're very floppy, but they will sit there if you want them to. Now, a few tips that I'd like to share if you're going to knit these bears. Uh, I'm just working on Mummy Bear at the moment. Um, and the few things that I've found is it is worth marking the ends of the cast-on row. <clears throat> now, um, you start off with only 14 stitches but you very quickly get up to about 56 so when you come uh, on a lot of pieces you have to gather the cast on row and it is quite difficult you can find the start of it with the yarn but the other end can be quite difficult to find among all the fur so what I do as I begin I mark the end of the cast on row with one of these stitch markers which I find really useful because then I can quickly and easily gather that up. Uh, these little stitch markers come in packs of different sizes, different colours and I find them really useful for marking uh, row ends and, uh, and other things. Um, again, the, um, the right and wrong side of the knitting is quite hard to find out because it's very difficult to get among the fur and just see which side you're working on. So again, once I've done a few stitches, I mark the right side of the work, and then when I come to sew it up, you put the right sides together, sew it together, and when you turn it right side out again, you can just take your stitch marker off. So those are a few tips that might help you. The same with the head. Once you've um, stitched it together, it is a bit hard to find the muzzle and that's where you sew the nose so again once I've gathered the stitches I pop a little stitch marker on the end and when I've sewn it together I shall know exactly where to put the muzzle uh, the nose on the muzzle it's the same with the ears again it's a bit hard among all the fur to find out which is the top, the bottom or the sides uh, when you make them up, you sew the cast on and the cast off edges together. So when I've done that, I just mark them with a stitch marker. And then I know that that will be the edge that is sewn to the head of the teddy bear as I make them up. So I hope you enjoy making the bears. I really have enjoyed it. And uh, if you'd like to share a picture of your bear, I'd be more than happy to see it. Happy knitting. See you soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.